You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chest. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chest. You got it on your mind, pop to get it. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy CJ back with another episode of Sports Talk. I got my man Rhino in the building. What's going on with you, Rhino? What's up, buddy? It's your boy Rhino. We got some more sports talk for you today, for you guys today, and let's get it. Let's go, CJ. Let's get it. Let's you got get for it. basketball. Let's get it. Let's get it, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Let's get it. So, uh, you know, since shit recently happened over the week, you know what I'm saying? We've been gone, but we back like we never left. But uh, Blake Griffin just signed with the Brooklyn Nets. You know what I'm saying? How you feel yeah. about that? And do you think it's going to work? Hey, why is KD building another super, super team when he was trying to go at it? I mean, yeah, I'm so like a hater. I love KD, but the way he just let the let the dubs is still like a bad taste in and, and, and our mouth. It's just it's, it's shit that we don't say, but he's, he's going to Brooklyn. He builds a super team. He has DeAndre Jordan. He has Blake Griffin. He has, he has Kyrie, and then now he has Harden. I mean, that's five, five superstars, but they've been playing nice. I mean... Blake Griffin, I guess he does um, bring that defensive pressure because he was in, in with Detroit doing it by himself, and so it's a chance. But I don't know if they can. I don't. I don't know. Actually, I I, I just really can't wait to see the Nets and the Lakers battle it out because that's all. I, that's what I see. Okay. Okay. See, this is how I feel about it. I like because it. I ain't going to say I like it. I like that Blake Griffin get a chance to uh, maybe contend for a title. Um, but it's not – It's not. It's, and, yeah, you know what? It depends on how how the books bounce back because they just traded for P.J. Tucker, which, you know what I'm saying, he, at least he gave oh, them yeah. some type of shooting. But uh, uh, it's not a guarantee they're going to make it out of the East. Huh? Yeah, didn't yeah, P.J. Tucker get traded to the Bucks? Yeah, got you to the books. So, yeah, but you know, it's not like, like I said, it's not a guarantee that they're gonna still make it out of this. It's, it's East. I mean, it's looking like it, but it, it ain't nothing ever guaranteed. But mm -hmm. my thing is, when in the hell is he gonna get a shot to? I mean, you can't say five superstars. No, keep it correct. They got four. Uh, <laughs> I would say three and a half. But I, I give it to them four. They got uh, because uh, DeAndre Jordan ain't no damn star. He ain't even no damn all star. He's he a role player. He didn't. Yeah. He do his damn job. You know what I'm saying? The good thing about that is. <laughs> Hit when uh Blake Griffin can run the five in late game situation while DeAndre Jordan sit on the bench because uh he ain't making no damn free throws. But uh mm -hmm. so yeah, we, my thing is like who gonna take the last shot? You know what I'm saying? That's that's that like they gonna literally have to it by them and Blake Griffin, they still ain't got no fucking defense. Where the mm -hmm. defense? And you know what I'm saying? DeAndre Jordan ain't like he's some big time shot blocker, he ain't man, sometimes he can't even block a call. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, but I, I think if the Bucks get it together late, the Bucks gonna be hard pressed against them. Like they, it ain't gonna don't guarantee they are gonna get past the Bucks. And, and, and I thought the Heat, I thought the Heat was gonna run it back, but they they got their struggles in Boston. I don't know what the fuck is going on with Boston, boy. Like, man, they just I have to say with Miami, you gotta wait till the playoffs before you can even like really see where they are because they were a surprise last year at the, in the bubble. I wasn't surprised. I wasn't surprised. They were, they were hooping all year. I was like, wow. I, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I, I, I knew that book series was gonna be tough, but I didn't think they was gonna beat them like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I knew it was gonna be a tough ass series. I had it seven, giving a slight edge to uh, it, it was really like I said when I say slight, it was slight edge to the books. With shit, the, the heat, like, but it could have went either way. But the heat said, fuck out of that. And it ain't going to be no seven. We're going to dog that ass. And they, you know what I'm saying? They did they, they did their thing. But, uh, and uh -huh. it's not guaranteed. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, say they do mean the finals with the Lakers. That shit going to be, it's going to be tough because they're going to have to outscore the Lakers every, every game, which is possible. Which mm -hmm. is very, very fucking possible. But if the Lakers clamp down on some defense, you know what I'm saying? Like, and it depends on KD too, because KD been out for a minute, man. And like, mm -hmm. we don't know how what, yeah, what's yeah, gonna yeah. happen when he come back. Is he back you know from his hamstring? Is he back huh? from his hamstring injury? Nah, he, he back. back he, he got he got to sit some more time out. He ain't, he ain't uh, back yet. I mean, which they don't really need him right now. Like, so yeah. he may come back refreshed, busting ass. Like, he was like uh, one of my top for MVP before he got hurt. You know what I'm saying? So. 
Yeah, you know I mean, I want I want to see I want to see him get like his fair share in this battle hit LeBron with his own team. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? LeBron, my favorite player. I want to see KD battle LeBron with his own team that he built together himself. Like we can't everybody get mad that Brooklyn doing all this. We don't say nothing with LeBron, do we? I don't. You know what I'm saying? And <laughs> uh LeBron do it like shit. I be like, yeah, hell yeah, add him, add him, add him, add him. And then when somebody else do it, I, I can't get mad because first of all, everybody that's on that team is very ball dominant. They yeah. need the ball in their hands. Ain't it? They ain't got no real catch and shoot players. But I, like I said, I like how hard me running the one. You know, with you know, he 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 he, he kind of stat pad a lot too. I don't give fuck nobody yeah. say hard and stat pad. You know, but, yeah, he does. That's why I didn't, I didn't understand why I sure what the Westbrook and uh and the Harden thing that wasn't that wasn't a good match. They both had stats. That's yeah. that's what they do. That's how they play the game. But but, but I see I've seen motherfuckers say LeBron be stat pad. No Harden stat pads. Like that's not. That's not, you know. Everybody stat pat separate Steph Curry. Nah, yeah, I fuck, and I fuck with Curry. I, I do fuck mm-hmm. with him. Well, yeah, you man. Think, I, uh, you, you think you really about to go to the Lakers? Because I've been to see the whole bunch of rumors. Man, Curry that ain't bullshit gonna online. Curry ain't going on. For real, for real. Let's keep it. Let's, I'm, Curry ain't going to be I'm, a warrior for I'm, life, I'm, man. I'm going to be real. Clay was, Clay was there. Warriors. Warriors. They already, like, I think a game behind ninth. I mean, a game behind eighth, if they not in eighth, God damn, something in my goddamn mind. You know what I'm saying? But they, they like, they there. But if, if Clay was there, I think they'd be a strong fourth, fifth, fourth, fifth, street, uh, fourth, fifth seed. Like, I could see that. You know what I'm saying? But I, don't, I think next year, I think next year they're going to be, I'm going to say next year they're going to be in the top five. Mark my words for it. Mm-hmm. Mark, mark, mark my yeah. words. Right? They're going to be in the top five. You know what I'm saying? Already know they in the are. West. They don't have uh, all of them back. And, 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 and you know what I'm saying? You know, Wiggins. I'm just, I'm just be Wiggins was one of the biggest bust ever. Huh? Who? That motherfucker was one of the biggest bust ever, bro. Like, Wiggins, man, this is like he just there to collect uh, his check. Like, he don't even got no, like, no, no yeah, games, just, no dogs to him. He just did. Like, yeah. they, talk, yeah. they talk all that yeah. shit about Oubre. But Ubre be this doing this, but Ubre, at least Ubre, Ubre is trying. Ubre, 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 Ubre you know what I'm saying? Ubre got hard. Ubre. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, go ahead. I don't like, like Ubre, but um, Wiggins is is so inconsistent. Like sometimes you'll see that that superstar presence from him, and then the next thing you'll see just be ass. Next, the next game will just he just there. Like I said, sure. he ain't got no motivation. He's just there to collect the check. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Going by when, that's- yeah, I, I, but I like, I like Uber. At least Uber, Uber trying to, trying to win. He ain't just there, mm-hmm. just to fucking be there. But they, they give him so much shit. But with, like I said, with, as they doing all that, Draymond just hiding under the bushes because he <laughs> play like ass too. Like I said, it's <laughs> because he don't score. He play like ass. Okay, man. Yeah, that's what he does. Real, real, real quick, real quick. Go ahead, get into your. Uh, Hop up on it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Hop up on it. Let the people know what's going on. Has been crazy. Has been crazy. The frenzy has been crazy since uh, that trade for Matthew Sapper for three first round, first round draft picks to to the Rams, which I still can't believe. But there's a lot of rumors going around that Russell Wilson might be getting traded, which I highly doubt. And got some good pickups for my team. Niners got some good pickups. I'm glad they resigned Trey Williams, but. I think they really overpaid him, but in in analogy they had to because they had two other suitors going after him. The Colts and the, and the Chiefs were going after going after the all line, the all linemen, and they paid him a good six years for 138 million for the contract. And I'm glad that uh, my team was signed some key players into the into the team. But what I really what one thing one this the free agency thing is really crazy in, in March. Like you don't know what's gonna happen, what's gonna pop off, who's gonna go where. And it's all determined about the market, who signs their contract first and stuff. But I actually I'm actually excited. I'm excited for the football season. Okay, what you okay. think? What I you? I ain't been paying too much to the free agency. I ain't really been paying too much to football. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I 
Yeah, yeah, fuck them. But I'm, I, really I, can't see, for, I really can't I, wait for the I draft. Did, I, did see, right I did see uh, Cam Newton. Uh, we shine for, I'm always rooting for the brothers, so salute to Cam for getting that. Uh, free to Sean Watson. You know what I'm saying? Free Russell Wilson. Free my brothers. You know what I'm saying? Let them compete, man. You know what I'm saying? But right, I am right. glad that That's you, another thing I want to touch on about Cam Newton, though. Cam, you need to give that man some respect. I mean, yeah, just because what he did in the Super Bowl, y'all, 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 y'all really disrespect that man. And that man's a baller. I can't even hate on Cam Newton. Cam Newton is a beast. And what he did last year, he had basically no weapons at all. He had a bunch of rookie and no name wide receivers to throw to. And he had a depleted offense that some key players from that defense uh, did not come back from COVID. But I do love that Billy Bill. Bill Belichick attack on free agency really shows that he got him fucked up. Just because Tom Brady won that Super Bowl doesn't mean that he's a, he's not a good coach. But all right, we'll, we'll, see. Yeah. we'll see. Oh yeah, and Dak. How can I forget about Dak? Salute to Dak for getting his paper too, man. Go oh on, yeah, Zach, man. Back, man. Get your money. I'm glad you got your money, but the Cowboys ain't shit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hey, it is. It is a dad. But yeah, man, we don't want to hold y'all up too long, man. Give y'all a little. Oh yeah, real, 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 real quick, real quick. March Madness. Who you got and why? Man, they took out both of my. I mean, both of my teams are not. I, I mean, if it if it had to be something, it would be Kansas. But they're out. I like Kansas State, but they're out because of COVID. And Duke Duke is out, and that's my. I, I love Duke, so I really don't have a favorite this year for March Madness. Yeah. I don't really have no favorite this year either. But if y'all doing the brackets, man, good luck. I just don't trust it this year because at, at the one cough, the team is out. So you know what I'm saying? Like they out to oh, do the COVID, oh. especially a team that you think gonna win. They out do the COVID. That's why I don't trust it. Mm-hmm. So, but if y'all got faith in it, then hey, that's on y'all. But hey. But uh, that's, you know what I'm saying, we, that's, all, that's all we got for y'all. I wanted to give y'all a quick little episode, you know what I'm saying? I know y'all miss our faces, you know what I'm saying? We went in here last week, you know. Yeah. But, uh, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to us. Subscribe yeah, we, to, to Sports Spot. Yeah, yeah, we always, we always, we always forget about, forget about saying that. So like, comment, yeah. subscribe, share, 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 sure. share. Y'all got a topic. Sure. Y'all got what topic y'all want to get on? Let us know. We will cover it, God damn it. If you, you want to get on and talk some sports with us, hit us up in the DMs on the we Get Out Your Test you. podcast on the Instagram. We got you. But that's it. I got, well, that's all I got for tonight. You have a good one. Peace. Peace out. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chest. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chest. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chest.